The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Stone Mountain, Georgia, weighing in at 249 pounds, Jake the Snake Roberts. It's time for the snake, guys. And what I like about Jake Roberts is that he doesn't back down from anybody. Guys, this match will undoubtedly go a long way in determining just who is the most dominant superstar. That's what makes this match so great. These superstars clearly have a point to prove here tonight and will likely do anything necessary to go ahead and prove that point. comes Chris Jericho. And Cole, I was able to get a sneak peek at the list earlier today and can tell you that both you and Saxton are toward the top. I'm sorry to be the bearer of bad news. And guys, you can bet there are plenty of superstars in the back crowded around the monitor for this one. Yeah, this really is an intriguing matchup, Cole, and the end result can very well trigger a domino effect on the rest of the roster. Few have had as celebrated a career as Chris Jericho. Jericho is an expert aerialist, superb Mac technician, and a master manipulator. And to be very clear, few are as dangerous. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Am I the only one that sees he's cheating? He's simply reminding him that he's here. Jake Roberts with some good timing here. Okay, guys, I wanted to talk a little bit about Chris Jericho here. For those that haven't seen much of him, what can we expect tactic-wise from him tonight? When you have two competitors this talented and focused, it's anybody's guess how it's going to shake out. Well, one of these guys is definitely going to make his mark in this division. Which one? Well, that is yet to be determined. There's been a turbulent relationship between Chris Jericho and the WWE Universe over the years, and it's a shame when icons aren't celebrated. But when it comes down to it, everybody knows Y2J is a winner and an all-time great. Made him pay there. Whoa, missed by a large margin there. Come on, how do you miss by that much? Jake the Snake Roberts making his presence known. Three. Off the top rope, delivering the powerful axe handle. The WWE Universe is quite the history with Chris Jericho. One thing is for sure, the WWE Universe may not always agree with Jericho's methods, but they respect him. I don't doubt that the WWE Universe considers Y2J an all-time great. I think that's exactly why they don't understand why he conducts himself the way he does. Jericho is so good, he doesn't have to take the low road. Y2J is starting to fade. I'm not sure how much more he has to give. He's really starting to look fatigued here, guys. And when that happens, your whole body starts to give out on you. He's going to need to be careful here. He has to be disappointed in this performance. He really is so much better than Larian. Can he end it here? But now, shoulders down. Is it enough? One, two, three. 
chalk up another one. Here is your winner, Jake the Snake Roberts. Well, that one was over before it even started. This was all about one competitor's refusal to lose. When you see that, you have no choice but to respect it. And that'll do it here for this one-on-one -on -one match. I hope you enjoyed it as much as this live crowd appears to have enjoyed it.